foggy. What's going on, guys? It's Trump here, and we're bringing you some zombies. That's right, I said zombies. We've never seen zombies before in my channel. Yeah, if you've been here a while, you might have. But, because I've uploaded, I think, Moon Play series. Or, yeah, Moon Play series on a couple. Well, as soon as it came out, basically, we basically But that was a long time ago, and there was like eight parts to it, which I'm not going to do that again. That's why I'm on round 27 right now, not on round 1 starting this, because if I were on round 1 right now, there would be about 15 parts to this video, <laughs> or to this uh, playthrough, which is really annoying on my part, and on your part, because you have to go around and walk me, and there might be some boring parts to me, which I think early rounds on zombies are quite boring to people that watch me. That's why I started playing uh, recording on 27. So it wouldn't be that boring. And I, right now I have the AK, some for you, ray gun, and stab. And I have a pack of the AK, and I stab. A couple of scavengers. There's a day called the Dead. It's like only on Call of the Dead. And it's, in my opinion, the best game of all. Because. It just kills everyone. It's like a sniper rifle. It explodes. You'll see. You'll see whenever I pull it out. <laughs> it's amazing. But anyway, as you notice, I have all the perks. Well, except all the perks except for dead shot deck here, which you'll get. And if you're wondering how I got all the perks, because you can only get, you can only buy four perks. And how I got it was I killed George, which basically it's really hard. Gotta shoot him a lot of times. That's why I have a scavenger. Scavenger really helps. And uh, it's really so good. But what happens is you'll see I kill him in a minute, but he like gets all he like falls to the ground and he gets back up and runs to the water and he wants to put the in the water and he drops like a perk bottle, like an ascension and a death machine. But if you've done the Easter egg, then you will he will drop a Warner Waffle a instead of a Death Machine, which is good. But Death Machine is a good one. I still have around 27. I'd rather just do what I do right here. But it does get you some points, which, if you notice, I have 56,000 points. I don't really need any more points. So. Kind of defeats the purpose of killing George unless you've done the whole Easter egg, <clears throat> which I've done it before, but I did it on Xbox when it first came out because I was like obsessed with this map when it first came out on Xbox. And if you didn't know, all the map packs come out on Xbox before PS3, so I just played it and played it and played it over and over again on Xbox and to the Easter egg, and I just didn't even bother to win the Easter egg in the way. But, um, I want to talk about which I thought I didn't have because no one has been, like, telling me if they were playing, which was kind of hard on my part to have a tournament if there's not going to be anybody playing. So, I'm going to ask you guys, if you, if you don't want to play in it, you want to compete in a free tournament, or you can win a $20 on PS3. Just all you have to do is message me on YouTube, or you can send me an, an invite on my phone. Oh, no, 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 so if you want to play in a free tournament where you could possibly win on the PSN, go ahead and do that. All the rules, only thing you have to do is subscribe, and that's basically it. And I will, once I get enough people, I'll post a video saying all that junk. All the rules, like on the tournament, like what kind of gun you can use, and and in the last tournament, it went okay. We only had like 15 people in it, but it was it was pretty fun. Like uh, there was several in the national We had it, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna do a single animation. I had to do it in two separate days, 
But I want to do it in yeah. one day. Because, for one, I, did, I think I did this during the summer last time. And, uh, I have school in the morning. I can't really spend all my time on video games. I have to do homework and other things. So I'm going to have to do that on a weekend. And it's going to be in one day. So that'll be uh, pretty difficult to get in. And uh, the other thing I want to talk about is Black Ops 2. Yeah, I know. No one's even talking about Black Ops 2. None of the big commentators are doing that. So, <laughs> I'm gonna do that over here, and then I'm gonna talk about zombies and a little bit of multiplayer. Because I like zombies, and that's what, I look, that's what I'm looking forward to uh, the most in Black Ops 2. Because every Call of Duty has multiplayer. But not every Call of Duty you get zombies. Which, there's only been two games of zombies in here. Not including Black Ops. There will be three games. Three Call of Duty games with zombies. But, uh, so I'm gonna talk about zombies. And if you notice here, I have lots of zombies following me. And there's a total of 24 of them. Because on Black Ops and World at War, only 24 zombies can be alive at a single time. So, let's see how there's 24 zombies right here. You can't even, no more zombies can spawn until I kill more zombies. Like, so if there's 24 zombies right there, I kill one zombie. One more zombie will spawn and add on 24. But on Black Ops 2, <laughs> they're doubling it and making it 48 zombies. Which is insane. I mean, just look. Just, well, look at all those zombies. Um, that looks like a ton of zombies. But it's only 24. I'm just saying, it's gonna be double. Oh, that's gonna be insane. And they're also making it where it can be eight player co-op, which is also insane. But it will it will make it harder. I don't know how they're gonna do this, they're gonna have to make some more really, really big like Call of Dead is a big map anyway. It's, they're probably gonna have to make it like twice the size of Call of the Dead, which is it's hard to imagine for a zombie map. And they're making the zombies smarter, I think. So you see how these zombies are just like following me, not even trying to cut me off. Well, in Black Ops, there'll be like, there'll be a few smart zombies that'll go and try to cut me off, throw me down, or the rest of the group get me. So that'll be more of a challenge. So you just can't run this train all day and do the same thing over and over again. Which is what I'm doing. And um. And there's gonna be a whole zombie which that's hard to imagine. Because I'm not even focusing on the stuff. They're just focusing on the zombie campaign. Meaning like you know how on single player on Black Ops, for example, there's like twenty missions of camp of just regular single player missions that you can play. There'll be twenty there'll be something like that. Something within that range. Twenty to 20 to 10 of uh, zombie maps or zombie games. I don't know how they're gonna do it. I don't know if they're just gonna be like all those other people explaining, talking to you. Like, you know how I'm a single player game would be. But I don't know if it's just gonna be just like this, where you're by yourself trying to survive zombies. I think that they're, uh, I know that they're changing the It's just survival right now. I don't think zombies. so! Black Ops 2. They're gonna add, like, game modes. So, you can have 4v4. Like, it'll be a multiplayer. Slash zombies. Cause it's, it'll be like... Four people surviving against zombies. And then another four people surviving against zombies. And those two teams of four people will be fighting each other. Mixed with zombies. It's hard to explain. So, it's like... A team tactical, because team tactical has four, four players in each. It's like team tactical mixed with zombies, but there's no like uh, objective type thing, so you don't have to capture flags or anything like that. You just kind of survive. But I think they'll may change that a little, which I kind of hope they do. But I hope they have the ability to just get regular zombies, like how they do. Oh, and if you notice, I'm getting ready to kill George. Put you in your place, didn't I? Yeah. He's down. Yeah. 
he will drop a perk and a dash. And that's how I had him use all eight perks. And all seven perks. No, eight perks. Who's seven perks? Yeah. All seven perks. That's how you get all seven perks because if you just have a power perk, you can only get four. You have to kill your do a special thing oh. for each move. I noticed this death machine and it's not even a I mean it is, but it takes a lot of moves for a death machine. That's why I don't really think that the death machine is worth it. Pass round 20. Because it takes a lot of moves for a zombie. But I'm not for black ups to multiplayer. Multiplayer, I don't really know much about it, but I've seen a few videos on it. It looks, it looks like Black Ops, but with Modern Warfare 3 mixed in together. Like, it has the look of Black Ops and the feel of Modern Warfare 3, if you know, if you know what I mean. Like, it's fast paced, like Modern Warfare 3, but it, like, all the guns and stuff, all the buildings and everything else look like Black Ops. Which, I kind of want it the other way around, because I feel that... Infinity Ward makes the map only better and prettier. While well, I think that I like my Treyarch's uh, not as fast as games for games because I just don't really like rushing around. Like Modern Warfare 3, it wasn't really that fun of a game for me. It was probably the worst Call of Duty I've played. Fun like, I didn't have as much. I've had more fun with Call of Duty 4 than Modern Warfare 3. That fun for me it was so fast paced. I don't know why. It didn't really feel like it was realistic. I still wouldn't call this that. Which I know Call of Duty isn't realistic for a while. But it didn't even come close to feeling realistic. So, uh, in Black Ops 2, they're, they're adding a few new games, which I don't know what they are. Now, I don't know if they're gonna have a. Oh no. Yeah, this is when I was kind of nervous, because I went down and basically if you don't have Juggernaut, it takes like one hit, sometimes two hits, so I was kind of worried here about being down there so quick, I thought I still had PhD Flopper, which PhD yes! Flopper blocks off, there's some damage, oh gosh, boom, see that's what the scat does, kills everything, I love the sound, the sound of it is awesome. And, uh, oh god, I'm just, I'm just like, uh, scared to be watching them when I've already played. But, uh, anyway, Black Ops has a few new game modes. I don't know if they're doing the, what's it called, like, one in the chamber, those type game modes, competitive game modes, game modes. So, uh, they're adding lots of new guns. Since it's set in 2025, they're adding new kill streaks and everything. It'd be cool, but I'm looking forward to zombies. And if you guys still haven't, if you haven't sent me a message or if you haven't added me on PlayStation to play in the tournament, you guys please do that because I really need some people to play in the tournament. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. This was a long video. But if you've lost this one, which I doubt no, none of you will, I need you to leave a like and comment saying that you lasted. 14 minutes of this video so if you do that I will be happy and it might uh I might do something I like I might feature your channel I don't know I'm in a good mood right now so that did that and I just dropped my microphone so uh I'll see you guys in the next video and I'll try not to drop my microphone anymore I hope it's not broke all right see ya I turned down the Royal Shakespeare Company for this. What does fish juice have to do?